chemical businesses in China and the U.S., along with dependent sectors downstream in the supply chain, are currently trapped in dire straits amid a protracted and worsening trade war between the two countries. As evidenced by export performance last year, the U.S. chemical industry is the most negatively affected sector by the increase in tariffs. According to the ACC, U.S. chemical exports to China rose by only 2.7% in 2018, a marked contrast with their double-digit growth in 2016 and 2017. Unlike a poorer or average producers, chemical businesses have little room to maneuver on. For example, the commoventing duties by tariff classification. Even worse, some chemical components on U.S. business shopping list are available only in China and they represent critical inputs to U.S. manufacturing. In a statement released by the ACC, the trade group voiced their concerns of increased tariffs, stating that it is starting to see signs that the tariffs are disrupting supply chains, cutting off markets and eroding U.S. chemical manufacturing competitiveness. In recent years, China has been imposing more and more stringent environmental re regulations on chemical businesses by launching several rounds of inspection on environmental protection accountability, vowing to investigate violations of environmental protection laws. Such a worrisome policy environment, which results in rectification, relocation, and even shutdown of thousands of businesses dampens this short-term domestic demand for chemicals. Therefore, higher tariffs collected by the U.S., one of the major destinations of Chinese chemical exports, undoubtedly make matters harder for Chinese businesses at this juncture. As their U.S. counterparts, Chinese exporters will face higher export costs. It is conceivable that U.S. importers will negotiate harder as they do not want to bear the costs alone. When exporters are crippled, some Chinese manufacturers will resort to domestic sales, which will intensify competition in the domestic market. Now, the top priority for China and the U.S. is still to find common ground and reach a trade deal in a bid to establish some trade relations which can be conducive to benefit both sides. It is reported that Chinese President Xi Jinping is going to meet U.S. President Donald Trump next week at G20 in Japan. Hopefully, that will bring some good news to both sides. Camlinked will keep a close eye on the latest developments. Thank you.